minute and review some of the tools you use for these procedures. The Phoenix injection system, 3 8 ratchet, deep sockets in 12 point and 6 point configurations. You'll need torque wrenches, both foot pounds and inch pounds. You'll want a half inch drive ratchet along with 3 8 drive ratchet, quarter inch drive ratchet, a number of extensions. You'll need adapters from half inch to 3 8. You'll need a handful of wrenches, both short, metric, and long style handles. You'll need flange pliers. You'll need conventional pliers, retaining ring pliers, safety glasses, vice grips. You'll need electrical tape. You'll want an assortment of Torx bits, Allen bits, some of the Allens you will need in metric. You'll want large Allens. You'll want T-handle Allens. You'll also need Phillips, straight blade, and I do like to use a Torx style screwdriver handled tool. You'll want long configuration screwdrivers. Again, some of them covered with a rubber hose to protect chrome and painted surfaces. You'll need specialty tools, such as a fork tube cap socket and a palm ratchet. You'll want a metal ruler or scale. You'll also need a wheel seal puller. You'll need a belt tension gauge. You'll need a shock spanner adjuster wrench. You'll need a tool to remove excessive fork fluid when the manual calls for that procedure to be done that way. You'll want steel tapered bars. This one we used when we did front axle alignment. You can also use a 7 16 drill bit. You'll need a hand impact driver for fasteners that are frozen or torqued to a high foot pound setting. You'll want a spark plug gap gauge. You'll need a wire gauge for wheel alignment on certain models. If you're doing a fall away procedure, you'll want a long length of wire as a pointer to the front fender. You'll need hammers in conventional steel and rubber dead blow styles. You'll want straps. Safety is a priority. You'll want a wheel bearing packer You'll also need an oil filter wrench. Again, these tools are just a sample of what you may use or what you may prefer when doing service on your Harley Davidson motorcycle. One of the most important tools I feel you'll need will be a factory authorized service manual. Loctite products. They make a number of thread lockers, anti-seize in stick and liquid configuration. They make clean and prime. They make a freeze and release product for frozen hardware. They make high tack stick, disc brake quiet stick, and all the lubricants and grease you'll need for proper servicing.